Allah, uh, blessed people. Uh, this is about 10, 7 a.m. East African time on Tuesday, the 3rd of March, the year 2020. Uh, the Lord Jehovah has uh, spoken with me in a very, very tremendous, in a very shocking way this past night. Again, the Lord, the creator of heaven and earth, the omnipotent God of Israel, the most terrible God of Jacob, the mighty God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Israel, the God of Jacob. He spoke with me this past night in a very, very tremendous way. And the Lord has spoken about the coming of the Messiah. And in this conversation this past night, the Lord Jehovah did present his servants before him. And so this night, the two prophets of the Lord stood before the Lord. And the Lord commanded them to strike the earth. And when I did as the Lord had commanded me, and struck the earth with my left prophetic hand, then all of a sudden, blessed people, all of a sudden, a tremendous plague of flies stormed the earth, stormed the land. I don't know whichever, whatever the part of the world it will begin from, but it was totally unsightly. It was very shocking to see the plague of flies and the trillions of flies together and moving and pouring as though pouring from a sack. And sometimes they all blew, they all come and blew together on a certain place. It was totally unsightly. Oh, this night, and the Lord made me scratch myself like you won't believe it. Uh, it was totally unsightly. When the Lord commanded me to strike the earth, to strike the nations of the earth with the judgments of the Lamb, and in this case, with my left prophetic hand, to strike the land with the plague of flies. And it was totally unsightly to see. And he kept showing me this throughout the entire night. The entire night, unrelenting. I, I scratched myself. I scratched myself. Maybe people will scratch themselves when they see this. <coughs> Excuse me. People scratch themselves uncontrollably when they see this. I scratched myself uncontrollably. Huh? When I looked at the plague of flies, is totally unbearable that the Lord brought on the land. And the way there are so many at one site, they cover, and it's a lot of it, and they're flowing, and they're going from place to place, and they're covering people's bodies. They come and cover a whole house. They cover the entire house, such that the roof total, and then the gutter, and the walls, so you don't see even the door. Oh, it was unbelievable and sightly this first night. The Lord has commanded these things into being. Because of the hour, the hour that we have entered into, and because of the heedlessness of the nation and the blackmail of the nation, how the nations have not listened to the Lord. The Lord is destroying this earth. He has sent me to destroy this earth. So the Bible says, the Bible says very clearly, blessed people, and I did not know, I do not know whether the flies were responding to the boils, the plague of boils that I struck the earth with on the other day. I do not know why the flies, there must have been stench, there must be stench that is coming also. There are variable boils, you know, that are coming on the bodies, on the surfaces of bodies, of skin. That's totally precisely. The Bible says, the book of Exodus chapter 8. Exodus chapter 8, blessed people. Verses 20 to 22. And it says, 
And the Lord said to Moses, Rise early in the morning and stand before Pharaoh as he comes out of the water. Then say to him, Thus says the Lord, Let my people go that they may serve me. Or else if I will, or else if you will not let my people go, behold, I will send swarms of flies on you and your servants, on your people, and into your houses. The houses of the Egyptians shall be full of swarms of flies, and also the ground on which they stand. And in that day I will set apart the land of Goshen, in which my people dwell, that no swarms of flies shall be there, in order that you may know that I am the Lord in the midst of the land. Tremendous signs, blessed people. The Messiah is coming. The Lord has now sent his servant to unleash, to execute the judgments of the Lamb. And they are totally unbearable. They are totally unbearable. The most terrible prophets of the Lord. The ones that come to destroy the earth. The ones that will bring to demise one quarter of the population of this earth. The ones that are threatened to bring the earth on its knees using the coronavirus. I see the tremendous plague of flies that is now strictly going to come based on the words of my, my tongue. And they are unsightly. I scratched myself the whole night. And he kept showing me throughout the entire night. It's unsightly. They come and cover a whole house. They cover houses. They cover roads and rails and what? There is nowhere to touch. He's coming to destroy this earth now. Strictly based on the words of my tongue. For those that love the life on the earth, there you go now. Believe the last for. Repent and receive Christ Jesus and be holy. And let the fallen church, the fallen church, let the fallen church now repent, the posted church, and listen to the counsel of this voice, of he that speaks with you today, and they will see eternity in heaven. Otherwise they will know that the Lord has struck the earth with a curse. The Messiah is coming to the earth.